Hello guys and welcome to episode 3 of teaching you how to use your computer for dummies. So in this episode we're going to be looking at how to uninstall an unwanted program. So say for instance you downloaded a program, you didn't know what it was, you've installed it or you've got a program that you no longer use and you want to free up memory on your computer, well this is the way to do it. So you want to head to the start button we're using Windows 7 so this may be slightly different if you're using an earlier version if we click it then we want to head over to the control panel click that and then you'll see an options menu here and we want to head down to the bit called programs now we want to uninstall a program so we want to click on the uninstall a program button here and then it will give you a list of all current programs installed on your computer so let's just choose a program to uninstall so for this example we're going to be uninstalling this program here called Cyberlink Power DVD because my trial period is up and I don't have any money to buy it so we're going to uninstall this program uh, the list gives you a list of uh, the names of the programs the publisher of the programs when it was installed the size of them and the version so this will help you out if you get stuck with or if you install a program that doesn't seem to work and you want to revert to the old style program or you've got two programs installed of the same thing one's an earlier version one's a newer version something so we're going to uninstall cyberlink power dvd so make sure that this is clicked and it's highlighted if we go up to uninstall just click the uninstall button and power dvd will uninstall itself and remove itself from your computer this will free up 365 megabytes worth of computer space that you can use to install other programs or or just to make your computer a little bit faster so a message comes up saying this will remove cyber power link dvd to, from your computer do you wish to proceed yes we want to proceed so we're going to click the yes button So would you like to keep your personal settings for Cyberlink Power DVD 13? Now this option comes up with certain programs just in case you wish to install them again later on. Um, it will keep uh, certain settings or user preferences on your computer just so that you don't have to re-enter them if you choose to uninstall the software later on. So we don't want to keep any um, information because we probably won't install it again so I'm going to click on no. Now when you uninstall in a program, sometimes it requires your computer to be reset. So don't be too worried if a message box comes up forcing you to reset um, your computer as this will then get rid of the program completely. However, un, um, someone installs do not require reset so will just remove themselves straight away. So as you can see this is the setup status so at the moment it's uh, removing backup files and uninstalls may take a couple of seconds may take a few minutes it all depends on how your PC is how quick it is the software um, that's installed on it and how fast your components are in your PC so this didn't take too long so cyber power link DVD was successfully uninstalled from your computer and all we need to do now is click finish so now you notice that Cyber Power Link DVD has now been removed from this list which now means that it's been uninstalled on your system so you won't be able to access it anymore because it's been deleted um, if you click on the start button and go to all programs you may find that some um, installs leave their folder around um, so in this case if we look for cyber powering dvd we can't see it on here so therefore it has been deleted however some programs do leave their um, directories on your programs list so all you have to do is just right click and then click delete and it will get rid of them from your start menu and that's pretty much it a nice easy way to uninstall a program i hope you enjoyed the video and i hope you learned something if you do like this video then please give it a like and do subscribe to us if you want to see more videos that we've done. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.